Hello everyone, so now I'm going to be reviewing this Rilakkuma. Um, this is a little, it's only very, very small um, Rilakkuma notepad. Well, it's like a memo pad, really. So this is what it looks like on the side. Little Rilakkumas, and on the back. As you can see, it's quite, quite sparkly. So the Japanese writing at the bottom. Um... So the outer packaging is very shiny. And this is how big it is. It's a bit bigger than my than my finger. It's really only very very small. Um, if we open it up, we get more little little tiny really cool man. Which is really cute. So we open it up again and again. It's quite a long long pad so this is the first type of sticky note that you get it's like memo paper you get quite a few sheets and um, obviously all these ones behind it are the same and um, so this is a really cool in a pink top little beard on I guess it's really cool next we get these ones these are like little strips so you get, you get these white ones and then above it you get these pink ones um, the only difference between these two pink ones and these three white ones are that the r little Rilakkumas are different on the side. See if I can focus. See, they're all doing like different things. Um, but the paper and the colours are like virtually the same. So next we have this one. This is more of a purpley colour paper. And again, you get quite a few sheets. If you want one, you just peel it off at the top. It's sticky here, so it all stuck together. You just peel it off. Um, this is more of a lilac-y purple one, and this really cool one has a yellow top on with a with a healthy little apple. So now, I'm, I'm sorry, I've got the shaky camera. We open this side. Start at the end again. This is the little really cool in the kitchen. And he's got a little kettle, a spoon, and a fork. And again. This has quite a few sheets on it. Next, we have two more square light ones. Um, these ones again are about half the size of these, and these memo pads are about the size of my finger. So these are like half, um, and these are sideways ones. Um, it also has a little line, so you'd be able to write on them as well. This real kuma has a little yellow top and a little pink flower. And this is more of the kitchen one with the kettle and the spoon fork. Finally, we have these. These are so cute. Just a little real kuma's head. Um, these are sideways ones as well. And look, you get quite a few in there as well. Um, they're not too dark, so if you were to write on it in pen, you'd be able to see it. And this character, I actually don't know who this one is. So if anyone knows, can you please leave a comment and let me know his name. Um, as you can see, they've both got different faces. So, let's see if I can get the whole thing in. So this is what it actually looks like. It's quite long, really. Um, and obviously each fold has pictures on it. And this one, and each side of it is really shiny. It's nice and little compact. Um, it's quite thick as well, so I have mine on my bookshelf um, for when I need sticky notes. Um, and the shininess gives it away really. But I think these are great. I picked this up on eBay. I think it was for like two ninety nine, two pound ninety nine. Um, but it come in great condition and. It's got so many sticky pads in it that I take this everywhere with me. I take it to school, I use it on school work and stuff like that. It's great. So, if anyone's interested, hop on eBay because that's where I got mine from. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye.